Is the Alpine Loop gonna ruin all other watch straps for you? I'm Air the Ho, I've been reviewing Apple Watch accessories for at least eight years now, and I'm gonna tell you what I think about the new Alpine Loop. Now these bands are technically designed for the new Apple Watch Ultra, but you can also use them with a Series 4 or newer. At $99, they are twice as much as the Sport Loop, Sport Band, Solo Loop, so are they twice as good? The question you're really gonna have to ask yourself is, do you like flexibility? So I'm gonna rifle through the pros, gonna rifle through the cons, and then elaborate on that flexibility question. When it comes to pros, the Alpine Loop is extremely flexible and moves well with my wrist. This is one of the thinnest watch straps that I've used, and I didn't notice it while hammering away on my computer. Putting the Alpine Loop is a bit more difficult for me as I've got small wrists but a normal sized hand, so I have to squeeze my hands into the loop. You secure this wrist strap by hooking the corrosion resistant titanium G hook into the loop. Holy frick marketing fluff. Once the hook is in, I can't think of any reason why the strap would come undone once it's hooked in. Those are the pros. Onto the cons. Friendly reminder, if you want to know what I think are the best Apple Watch accessories for the newest wrist computers, check that video out. We've got a playlist for all the new Apple Watch bands, so check that out as well. The only con I have about this product is that you do not get a perfect fit. Each loop is about the same distance as the holes in a typical watch strap. So if you've been wearing a sport loop as your go-to band, you're probably going to notice that the strap is either too tight or too loose. And the looseness is noticeable with the heavier Ultra, as you'll notice the watch moves more on your wrist. And when it's too tight, the edges of the strap start to dig into your wrist and leaves red marks. And that's the flexibility issue that I'm talking about. I just can't get the perfect fit with it like I have with the sport loop. For example, I can't find the right fit when I'm at the gym. If it's too tight, then I can't really use the grips or the straps because the G hook isn't the easiest thing to move. But if it's too loose, then I don't get proper heart rate readings. So is that flexibility with the fit a deal breaker for you? It kind of is for me. Now I'm annoyed, like my Apple Watch moves. The biggest pro about this product is that I can't think of any way that the strap will come undone. But the thing is, it's not as comfortable. So, you know, huh? I'm going to be doing a ton of other Apple Watch accessory reviews, so do hit the subscribe button if this is the first time you're watching one of my videos. If you're planning on getting one of these things, support me through my links. Thanks for watching.